to the gentleman from Louisiana, ranking member of the Aviation Subcommittee. The gentleman is recognized. Thank you. I want to thank the gentlelady from, from West Virginia. Mr. Speaker, thank you for, for the recognition. I, I, I want to thank uh, Congressman DeFazio, uh, uh, Chairman DeFazio, and Ranking Member Sam Grace for their work on this legislation. Once again, uh, Mr. Speaker, this is a demonstration of bipartisan cooperation, what we were sent here to do, as opposed to the politics that we've all seen that has uh, hijacked our government in recent months. Uh, the reality is, is that the real needs of the American public, and, and this is an example of that. This legislation is very simple. Um, airports are not like other traditional roadways. You have a runway that is usually, at most airports, one runway, and that's it. And so when that runway goes down, that airport can't function. They can't have flights come in. Uh, you can't have uh, commercial or general aviation operations. And so this legislation uh, very simply allows for incentive-based contracting, where you can reduce the amount of time that it takes you to do your construction project that diminishes delays on vacation, on family visits, on business travel, and all of the important things that are facilitated uh, by, by our aviation infrastructure, by airports. Um, and so uh, again, it simply allows allows us to more quickly address safety issues, capacity issues, expansion issues in airports. And the bottom line is this ultimately is a, is a saver for taxpayers because if we can resume operations, it allows the, the, the traveling public to advance, the economy to flow, and it allows the uh, aviation taxes to, to also continue flowing. So I, again, I want to thank Mr. DeFazio. I want to thank Congressman Larson, uh, Congressman Sam Graves, and all those who work together on this important legislation, and uh, I urge adoption. Yield back. The gentleman yields. The gentleman from California is recognized. Mr. Speaker, I reserve the balance of my time. Gentleman reserves. The gentlewoman from West Virginia is recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I yield myself such time as I may consume. Gentlewoman is 